Hi, Remy for SIGGLOMER.com. Today I'm in Trier, Germany, with Dave Kuros on malevolent creation. Hi, Dave. Hello. Uh, first question Could you tell me how the tour is going for you, especially after three years off? Oh, yeah. The tour has been going great. Uh, personally, my playing uh, has been up as, as good as I could hope it would be. I mean, uh, in the three years that I've been off, I've still been playing my drums on a routine basis. Uh, even though it may not have been death metal every day, I'm still playing and keeping my chops up. So, uh, you know, it's been no problem. I've had uh, you know, no fatigue or any problems like that playing the shows or anything like that. It's been good. The shows have all been pretty good. Too. How are you looking forward to the new album, Doomsday X? I'm really looking forward to it coming out. We've got uh, really good production on it so far. Uh, happy with the way all the songs came out. Uh, guest appearance on it as well from Mick from Slipknot. He laid down a killer lead on it. I'm happy with the way everything's come out so far. And we've got uh, Nuclear Blast so far is really behind us on it. They've already given us a full page color ad in the US. So, uh, uh, as it's going right now, it's, it's going good. So I'm anxious. There was uh, a lot of uh, bad talk about uh, Slipknot uh, guest. There was a lot of what? Bad, uh, bad talk. About? As a Slipknot uh, guest. Oh, no. Well, you know, that, that talk is all for people that don't understand it. Um, it's not used as a, a, a ploy or anything like that. We, we've been friends with Mick for years and years ago. He offered if he could ever do anything for any of our albums he'd love to. And uh, we had room on one of the songs for a solo. And we said, why not? You know, let's, let's ask him if he wants to do it still. So we called him up and said, of course I still want to do it. So, um, you know, it's, it's basically just uh, because he was a metalhead and a fan of the creation for so many years. And, Years ago, we asked to do it, and we decided to finally take him up on his offer. And uh, it worked out good because we ended up writing, uh, not writing, recording the new record uh, literally in the days before we came on this tour. So, by not having uh, the leads complete and having the room for this lead for Mick, still worked out good uh, because he did it while we were already on the road. And, you know, just to help complete it. In a few words, uh, could, you, could you give me the specs of, of your current drum kit on your pasty cymbal set? Um, my personal kit, I'm playing a 12, 13, 14 rack tom, 16 inch floor tom, two 18 by 22 inch kicks, and my cymbal setup is a 14 inch signature pasty hi hats, a 10 inch signature pasty splash. 17, 18, 19, rude, thin crash, and my China is the 2002 series. Um, I'm probably still going to do a back to signature because one of the reasons is 2002. And my ride is a 20 inch signature drive back. I've been using the same ride for years. But, uh, mm. Can you talk about uh, any US tour date yet? We don't have anything scheduled as of yet because we're really trying to get the album out and released, which is scheduled for June. So after June, you know, maybe in uh, July, late July, August, September, maybe something like that, we have something scheduled. But as of right now, uh, we don't have anything solid. And uh, any more news about your joint DVD project? Um, more news other than, you know, that I'm really working on making one happen? Not really. I mean, the, the specifics haven't been able to be talked about yet because I'm still on the road. So I'm going to contact uh, the gentleman who I've been speaking to about making the video right back. And, uh, hopefully it'll materialize a little bit more. But uh, it was all getting talked about so last minute, right before I went on this tour that it was too late to make anything happen before I went on the road. So when I get off this tour, in the time between now and uh, releasing the album, I'm going to do it. Thank you, Dave, for allowing me to do this interview and also to make a live footage. <laughs>